Hey guys, it's Donald Wombat here, and today is a follow-up on my How to Get a Kubro video. I'm bringing you my video on how to get the Mirage Warframe that was added also in Update 14. Once you know how to do it, the quest for Mirage is quite easy, but getting started and solving some of the riddles involved can be a little bit tricky if you don't know what you're looking for. If you enjoy this video and it helps you out, then remember to hit that like button. So let's get into it. Right. So, to attain the Mirage Warframe, you have to play through the Hidden Messages quest. To start the quest, you have to go to the market and buy the Hidden Messages Blueprint. To build the Hidden Messages Blueprint, you will have to require 5 Oricon Ciphers, which are a new item added in Update 14 as well. You get Oricon Ciphers by successfully opening Oricon Vaults. Vault runs are quite a common mission and there are a lot of people often asking for people to join their games in the Recruiting tab. But if you want to run them yourself, then you'll have to craft the 4 different Dragon Keys and also create Oricon Derelict Exterminate Keys. The, uh, the four different dragon keys are used for opening the actual vaults in-game, and the Oricon Derelict Exterminate keys are the best mission to be able to find vaults and open them. It is advisable to take a team of four into each one of these vault missions so that um, each person can have a different dragon key so that you'll always be able to open the vault. Once you have acquired the Oricon Ciphers, as well as some Oxium and an Argon Crystal, you will be able to craft the Hidden Messages Blueprint. It takes 6 hours to finish, but as usual, you can rush the build for some Platinum, if you feel that way inclined. Like the Howl of the Kubo quest, once it is finished building and you have collected it from the Foundry, you go to your Codex and then the Quest section, click on the Hidden Messages quest and begin the quest from there. Upon starting the quest, Ordus will tell you that there was something written on the item you just crafted, and he goes on to repeat this poem. Three parts, three acts, three riddles for thee. To revive the one wielding fantasy. Ancient God so cruel once rules from on high. Can you name their peak where the land meets the sky? Obviously the riddle wants you to find a certain location on the star chart. And in this case that location is Olympus on Mars. In ancient Greek mythology Mount Olympus was the home of the gods. Olympus is an infestation exterminant mission with levels ranging from 25 to 35. Upon completing this mission you will be rewarded with the Mirage Helmet Blueprint. To continue the quest, you must craft this and retrieve it from the foundry. Upon retrieving Mirage's helmet from the foundry, Ordus will tell you that he's found another, writ another riddle written on the helmet. It goes as follows. To build the one you think witty, seek the nymph who sang oh so pretty. She lured him in with her song and grin. His wife must have thought it was a pity. The corresponding star chart location for this riddle is Calypso on Saturn. In Greek mythology, Calypso was a nymph. Calypso was a nymph who, was, who is popularly remembered for her role in Homer's epic poem, Odyssey. It is said that Calypso enchanted her singing to trap the fabled Greek hero Odysseus in her island and make him her immortal husband, forcing Odysseus to be separated from his wife, Penelope. Calypso is an infested survival mission, and upon successfully completing this mission, you will be awarded with the Mirage Systems Blueprint. Once again, to continue the quest, you must build the systems and acquire it from the foundry. Surprise, surprise, but another riddle is written on the Mirage systems, and it goes as follows. One more act before your prize is caught. An ancient sea creature, take a whirl or not. Look for the monster that swallowed sailors of yore. Make a mistake and you're sunk, nothing more. Charbidius Sedna is the answer. In Greek mythology, Charbidi was a sea monster, later rationalised as a whirlpool, and considered a shipping hazard in the Strait of Messina. It is said that three times a day, Charbidius swallowed a huge amount of water before belching it back out again, creating large whirlpools capable of dragging a ship or even a galleon underwater. Charbidius is an infested hive sabotage mission with, enemies la with enemy levels ranging from 30 to 40. Upon completing this mission, you'll be rewarded with the Mirage Chassis Blueprint. Once built, Ordus finds another poem, poem inscripted on it. Three acts complete. The end draws near. Soon Mirage will cause fear. Memory lost to be reborn, a new warrior rises, duty sworn. To build the Mirage Warframe, you can buy the blueprint from the marker and you'll be able to construct it. Like other frames, it will take three days to be completed, but you can rush it with Platinum to get it more quickly. Okay guys, so that is going to wrap up this video on how to get the Mirage Warframe. If you have any question on the steps that I've taken in this video, please leave a comment below. If this video has helped you out, then remember to leave a like rating to help me out. Subscribe for more videos from me, I've been Wombat and I'll see you guys later.